Have you ever noticed that sometimes your body might react without you even thinking about it? For instance, if you touch something really hot, your hand might jerk back very quickly without you even knowing that you were doing it. Or if something comes close to your eyes, you might blink without even thinking about it. These responses that our body does are called reflexes. Reflexes are really important to helping keep our body safe and protecting us from danger. Today I'm going to show you how to create a tendon hammer to test a reflex in your body called the patella reflex or the knee jerk reflex. Here's how it's done. So to make your tendon hammer, you'll need two pencils, a rubber band and an eraser. To put your tendon hammer together, take your two pencils and place the eraser between the two pencils so the pencils support the eraser. Wrap your rubber band around a few times so that that eraser stays securely in place. Make sure that it is secure because this is what you'll be using to hit the tendon to test your knee jerk reflex. Test it out on the table to make sure it feels secure and you've got your tendon hammer all ready to go. Now to do some testing with your hammer. Have your subject sitting so that their feet aren't touching the floor and their leg is free. Take your hammer and you're wanting to bang firmly just below the kneecap. You should see a response and a knee jerk reaction of the lower leg. This is a good reflex response and it means that your test has worked. So what is happening here? When the tendon hammer strikes the patella tendon, this activates a message that travels to the spinal cord via a nerve called a sensory neuron. This message is then passed to a relay neuron or interneuron in the spinal cord. The relay neuron is very short and it acts as a messenger to pass the message along to the motor neuron. The signal travels down the motor neuron very quickly to the quadricep muscle to tell it to contract. The quad muscle contracts and this causes the knee to jerk and the leg to kick out. All of this happens so quickly without the brain getting involved. Body reflexes act in this way to protect the body from harm automatically and quickly. I hope you've had fun learning about reflexes and doing some testing with your new reflex hammer. This is actually a branch of science called neuroscience and it's something a lot of doctors, nurses, physios and other people in the medical profession use to make sure that your nervous system is working well. So keep testing with your hammer and I look forward to seeing you next time. Bye.